What is good, C-Squad? Today we're watching The Boondocks. A lot of you have recommended to me. One of the main shows that I watch on this channel is called The PJs, and a lot of you recommended this show because it's a lot like it. Look, I just like black humor, okay? And if you go on to enjoy this video, then make sure to like and subscribe. Let's try and get this video to 1,000 likes. And also, make sure to use code CAJ in the Fortnite item shop. Let's go. Jesus was black, Ronald Reagan was the devil, and the government is lying about 9-11. <laughs> what a way to start an episode jesus also side note i had to get max tv to watch this and bro their regular subscription with ads is ten dollars and their ad free edition is sixteen dollars god our society is going backwards oh your brother son the story that just begun the promise of what's to come and i'm gonna remain a soldier till the war is won i'm very excited to watch this show considering a lot of you told me that this is the show when it comes to african-american like based humor i am very excited <laughs> Um, what? What did I just watch? What the fuck? I know about white people too. Like when they talk, they say the whole word. I'm sorry, what? Does this kid just have a fucking gun? Just pointing it at random civilians? This show is amazing. I'm Robert Freeman. I'm Ed Wunsler from Wunsler Savings and Loan. Is he by chance related to the Wunsler from the Lorax? Also, this grandpa's last name is Freeman, kind of like Morgan Freeman. I mean, he kind of looks like him. Would you like some cheese? I'd love some cheese, thank you. Is that some white shit that I've never heard of? Is it normal to offer white people cheese in like suburbs? I just so happen to live in the land of the cheese. Wisconsin? And I despise cheese. Except for maybe sriracha cheese curds, those are pretty good. People of terror's descent. Dude, what the fuck is happening? Why is this kid ready to kill this innocent man? I'm genuinely lost on what's going on. He's... Is that right? Well, <laughs> this has been delightful. Pleasure, Mr. Uh... Does this kid just hate white people or what? Why can't we be ourselves, huh? Why can't I be me? Are you ashamed of us? Very. <laughs> <laughs> Grams did not hold back there. I'm lucky I'll find myself a nice white woman with a flat booty who will listen to my problems. Dude, I am so lost on what's going on. Like, I get the grandpa is like kinda trying to suck up to white people or something. Honestly, I'm just waiting for Uncle Ruckus. While I haven't watched the show, I do know who he is. I'm coming, I'm coming. Excuse me, out of the way, Kunta Kente. Yes, sir, uh, I can. <laughs> Just as I brought it up, there he is. Fuck yes, I love this character so much. Security, security, we got a cold black. There are some hungry looking niggas at the front gate. <laughs> Dude, this character is so good. God, he's so funny. What is with Uncle Ruckus? Does he just hate black people? Does he just hate every single black person equally or what? He's just so funny. Everything that comes out of his mouth is so wild, but just so funny. My little dude here looks dripped. Bombs blowing up. And you know, the shit scared me. It scared the shit out of me. Matter of fact, I shit on myself. Bro, Gramps is not liking any of this. Ronald Reagan was the devil. Ronald Wilson Reagan? 666? Wait, seriously? I never knew that. I mean, that sounds like some insane theory bullshit. These people aren't worried about us. They're not worried about anything. They're rich. I mean, hey, the kid's not wrong. People always say in life that money doesn't buy you happiness. Money doesn't buy you happiness outright, but it can buy you things to make you happy, and it can sure as shit make your life a lot less stressful. I want to sing y'all a brand new song I just wrote. Oh no, no, Ruckus, don't. Them happy, nappy head niggas with the fingers on the trigger. I don't trust them new niggas over there. Look, when you guys told me to watch this show, I thought it would have been okay, but holy fuck, this is great. Ah! Fuck y'all looking at- Duh, dude, he just gets shot point blank by a double barrel shotgun and lived? I know bullet vests are great at what they do, but a double barrel shotgun point blank? I feel like that would just penetrate through. R. Kelly is on trial again this week for sharing some of his liquid bling with yet another underage girl. Not R. Kelly, no. Yeah, doesn't this show have like a bunch of cameos? Like a lot of popular rappers from the 2000s? What did R. Kelly do to you? He's accused of relieving himself on an underage
underage girl on tape. Is this kid carrying out a free R. Kelly sign? That's so fucked. She saw piss coming. She stayed. Yeah, she did. And why but... should I have to miss out on the next R. Kelly album just for that? What is this kid yapping about? Is this show poking fun at fans of rappers who will just be by their side simply because they're fans of them? Which is true. If a rapper gets locked up and they have hard evidence against them, people will still say, like, free that person. It is prevalent in our day and age. R. Kelly supporters, where it's quite the festive event. And you are not guilty. Let's talk to another R. Kelly supporter. Oh, you there, urban youth. Why do you think R. Kelly is innocent? Did he just say urban youth? What? I knew it. Jesus, does everyone in this fucking show have a black belt in karate? God damn. Thank God for the white man's code of law. It's the only way to keep these crazy niggas under control. Wait, why is Uncle Ruckus and the grandpa just casually playing checkers in the in the park? I don't even think the old grandpa knew who he was in the first episode. Did they just become friends out of nowhere? Settle down. You have to go deliberate. I don't need to deliberate. That nigga now. <laughs> No, 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 no. Can I even put that in the video? I get that this was on Adult Swim, but holy shit. Uncle Ruckus is the greatest character ever. I just love that he just goes straight to accusing this person simply because he's black. In Tokyo, you could buy teenage girls' panties and vending machines. Do we call them disgusting? Yes, we do. What is this guy blabbering about? Let's get to the point. Now, some people see this so-called mountain of evidence. Wait, is this Adam West? Holy shit, it is Adam West. I only just realized that now. They got the thongs all up the booty crack and they got that sweet white nectar. Oh lord, how much that. Is Uncle Ruckus a snow bunny lover? I think he likes his chocolate more on the white side, if you know what I mean. That's so gross. Dude, this show is actually insane. They showed the grandfather dancing naked in the first episode, and now they're showing this? Hello. Yes, this is Robert Kelly. Yes, the singer. I know this is a cartoon, but oh my god. Ugh, I almost puked. <laughs> Would you describe yourself as an African-American woman? Nigga, you blind? I'm still baffled that this is Adam fucking West, the original voice actor for Batman, defending R. Kelly. Dude, this show is amazing. Who loves his black sisters, unlike District Attorney Dubois, <laughs> who's married to a white woman. <gasps> fuck does that have to do with anything? I know this show is going crazy over dramatic, but good god, that is so stupid. White man just a joy to be around. They gave us discipline, jobs, put structure in our lives, took us out the jungle. <laughs> Oh my god, holy fuck. Oh my god, Ruckus. I cannot believe what is coming out of his mouth. R. Kelly did urinate on this woman, but America urinated on R. Kelly. <laughs> I am beyond fucking in disbelief. I Every single one of my brain cells is leaving planet Earth. Even R. Kelly is like, what? We have a videotape. Go tell that to your white bitch. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I, I just I just can't. I can't. Dude, this show is just beyond amazing. This show is just everything and more. But anyway, have a good rest of your day.